At 10 o'clock this morning, hundreds of crafts filled the harbor near Fort Wool. In a two-mile procession, sailboats of every size and every stripe made their way across Hampton Roads. This year's parade leader is the Western Union, a 130-foot top schooner here from Philadelphia. Unlike the Fair Jean, a majestic brigantine from Canada, the Western Union is a work boat. It was built almost 50 years ago for the Telegraph Company and now is year-round home to 30 young men and women of Vision Quest, an organization for troubled teenagers. Practical skills like uh, Oh, learning to, to do some minor carpentry and the care and skill that's involved just in taking care of the sailboat, the marine skills that are involved. Um, they, in addition, continue academics while they're aboard the vessel, both navigationally and with the standard academics. Um, and again, learn to just be able to work through a whole day. I mean, the Western Union will be open to the public at Waterside this weekend. The very tall ships are not here this year but many local vessels joined the parade. At noon today, they lined Hospital Point, and hundreds crowded Town Point Park to watch the ships come in and to kick off Harbor Fest weekend 1985. Gene Bratman, 13 News, on the Elizabeth River.